Hello and welcome back to the Gage Look, and here we are with Let's Make the Vikings Great to start with, with the Imperium Eurival Universalis mod. Superb mod, still don't know what I'm doing and deliberately haven't researched too much because I think it's funnier that way. You can learn with me. So we have conquered these two provinces, this province, these two provinces and this province. However, realistically, we're making no money and to be honest, we're not in a great situation full stop. I'm not really sure what to do. We've went down the economic route. We could have got a colonist because we've got all these lands to colonize, but there's no way. I mean, look at our overall income. It's just insanely poor. Okay, religious authority. Probably need 10%, I imagine. Great power rankings. Babylon, Egypt, Lydia, Jinn. So you've got Babylonians, Egypt, Lydia... Is that in like around Syrian area? And obviously in China as well. We want to become a Viking Empire. Obviously we're not the Vikings, but we are Nordic and Germanic. So we have opportunity. Oh, we have a different culture group here, so we probably will change that. Population grows differently. It grows randomly, I think. Well, not randomly. It grows by sort of encouraging certain things like buildings encourage growth and the like. We certainly cannot afford buildings, so I'm not really sure what our next move is. Indeed, we can't really afford to do much at the moment, at all. We have quite a bad reputation. We have been aggressively expanding, I suppose, to not much avail. And there's no transfer. Corrupt general. Ugh, oh, yeah, let's just gain corruption, I think. Let's, we don't need to deal with corruption that quickly, though. Let's just bring that army maintenance all the way down. There are other ways to make profit. No, we have basically no profit. We can build a lot of boats. I'm just wondering if that is something we should think about. We certainly don't earn very much here. And this is a terrible trade node, honestly. Okay, gain the core. Obviously, we can't convert the culture because it's got separatism. These are getting a little bit better. The autonomy of this is really high, and this was one of my starting provinces. I don't really know what's going on with that. Maybe I... Oh, there was an event. It must have been that province. So we need we need pennies, basically. We're behind on institutions, of course, as well. I doubt we can drill our armies. No, we certainly don't have the money for that. We're probably at our army limit. Yep. I'm just intrigued by the boat situation. What's the maintenance of this boat? Can't remember how you can tell. Is there any way to tell? 0 0.03 a month. Let's build one more. So we're at 0 0.33 at the moment. I mean, that will change a little bit. I don't think we're going to have any separatist problems, to be honest. Now, this is where it gets interesting. Do I want to spend money on ideas? I think I do. Construction cost is not going to help us too much. Well, actually, it probably will help us greatly. Buildings are still like 100. So all of a sudden we're losing. Yeah, so that didn't really help. In fact, we've lost out on trade. Ah, okay. So, uh, construction cost plus 10%. Amazing. Our general has just... Sorry, our leader has just overwritten it. Oh, for God's sake. Oh, man, and this guy... And look, it's about the same price, so there's nothing can be done there. We have estates. It's just not an awful lot this does. This government organisation gives us a little boost, so let's have a little look here. Take privileges... Slave market. Okay. Let's take privileges and then let's do... Oh. Tribal gathering. Okay, so we got privileges. That's not going to help us. We're losing money because that slave trade element. Let's just check out the census. Economic stagnation. 
census, tribal population. We've got no slaves. I'm just, I'm wondering if we should abolish slaves. Production efficiency goes down by 10% though, which is insane. I'm, yeah, it doesn't, that's not going to work. What are we going to do? Just keep on with the tech. So we can study technology. Hmm, that's interesting. I'd like to see technology, if at all possible. Oh, I can see Scotland and England. Well, these people. So technology is better. Strange it's better there. How do you go about studying technology? I've seen this a few times, but I don't see the mechanic to do it. Let's see when it ticks. We just need money. There's no other sort of qualms about it. We just need money. Probably try and get into a war with these guys once we have enough trust. Did we already have enough trust, really? They're just not willing to help. Let's bring it up and let's use that trust just now. Okay, we can upgrade our military tech. Most of you guys are about the same as me. Still on the early Germanic warriors. upgrading our diplo tech quite soon. We're going to stay behind on admin tech because I wouldn't mind that national unrest. Well that's four ideas. Everything takes longer in this. Anything worth national tax modifier? Most of my money comes from tax. Maybe we could take a little punt on that. I seem to increase by nothing. I make no tax whatsoever, actually. God damn it. Because I don't have any commoners. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Oh. Keeps asking about that. I'm losing one population and moving it to there. There's no point. Let's just keep going down that absolutism route. It's going to make us a little bit extra money over time. It's not a whole lot to do though. Okay, take up technology. So we can study technology, but how does that work? Because I've seen that in the base game before and I've never quite figured it out. Let me just have a quick look. Let's just bring up a web browser. It's very unprofessional, of course, but... I do want to see. Study technology EU4. Oh. Apologies for that noise. Okay. Once you get to level 9, if you have a spy network in countries, we better you automatically get. Ah, okay. So we just need to find places with better technology than me and get a spy network. So, Remy it is. Let's build a spy network. And hopefully we'll get a small bonus. We, I don't know where we'll see it, but we will try. <laughs> and that's really all we can do. We can't use our points on anything. We can't convert you. Get another idea group, which we will. Although I'm not really sure why. Land maintenance modifier could be quite useful, actually. Not the army maintenance is particularly expensive. I really do want to train my soldiers, but I really want money as well. Oh, hello. I'm 
definitely just going to use points. Pointless otherwise. <laughs> Pointless. We are nothing. We are very little. It is a terrible trade mode. And I presume I couldn't like invade anyone over here. Okay, is that good enough tick? I know they're ahead on military tech. Ah, yeah, minus 3%. It's not much. It's alright. We're probably falling behind on technology. Yeah, we are. Okay. I understand the study technology now. Would it be worth studying technology from somebody else as well then? Oh, I'm starting to see more people. It's always quite cool. Study you guys as well. I'm not sure if that's how it works. I don't know if it'll stack, but we'll find out. You know what? I might just mothball you. Save me the money. Advanced metallurgy. Oh, God. It's another institution. Why is that spreading to you? I wonder. Why is that spreading to you? Ah, oh, ruler. The ruler has diplomatic skill of a certain level. God damn it. I'm not sure if you can get a institution in front of another one. That doesn't make sense, but I think you probably know what I mean. Okay, let's check this out. Okay, I'm not sure the double spy network is working. Let's just keep going. I wish I just got a random population growth. That'd be lovely. This is what happens when you don't play as Rome or Greece or something. Let's see some whales. Okay, the Rugai, your faithful ally, are requesting that you come to... They are allied with everybody in the world. And you are allied with very, very few people. Are you in that war as well? You are indeed. You're fine. Ah, oh, no. The hell with you. Decline it. My prestige takes a huge hit. I don't care. I don't want to fight in a war we're going to lose. I'm not a Viking yet. Vikings like to win. Okay, I reckon that double spy network might actually be having an effect. It's difficult to tell. So we're going to need some new allies. <laughs> We betrayed a bunch of people. Offer alliance to the the Gutons. Okay. Would you like some mercenaries? That would be my question now. What about you guys? Would you like some mercenaries? They probably would, but they can't quite afford it. What about my enemies? Would you like some mercenaries? These guys are pretty powerful looking, you know. Yeah, let's just ally with the Gutons. Looks like they're a trade nation anyway. I will need more allies for sure. God, it's taken so long to do anything. I'm not even getting to colonize. It's like the America games. Just harsh treatment them. There's no point. Okay, at least our absolutism is slowly growing. Price of iron. Uh, don't we have a copper province? That was just amber there, wasn't it? Yeah. 
Okay, another idea. Yeah, that's probably going to be worth it for us, that one. Yeah, there we go. There we go. We're in the money now. Oh. Got some random royalty-free music playing in the background, so it might seem a bit odd. One diplomat. There's nothing really to do with that diplomat. There was a merchant ship sunk, of course, because I've got loads of money. So the Angli look relatively powerful. So we may have to consider use a little bit of money. We just can't claim anything. Do you want mercenaries? Why would you want mercenaries? Doesn't make any sense. We're still stuck at the 7-7, seven, seven. yeah. Okay, the Rugai the Rugai won. Shit. Of course they did. They are new enemies. We need to get more powerful. Nothing's happening though. We're in the money now though. Look at this. Almost half. Population is 17. Oh, 170,000. Oh, that's cool. I like seeing that. Debase our currency. Yeah, we'd get bugger all. There's not really an awful lot we can do. Tribal army could be very helpful. Who's the great power looking? Uh, Lydia seems to have fallen a little bit. Our spy network is insanely good. Maybe there's a different mechanic for getting caught in this one. I want to build a market in my capital. That's all I want to do. I'm not asking for much. Border garrison. It's not going to work. I actually don't think I can build anywhere. Okay, there we go. Market. And is it? Sensible to build it there? Yeah, it's not like we've got any trade. That is our capital after all. Your unrest is almost down, come on. Maybe we won't bother with this edict anymore. Make a few more pennies. Oh, there we go, we're in the money. All joking aside, that's really good for us now. Half of our income is profit. Slavers on the coast. Hmm. It's quite a boost. We'll send him away. We need the prestige anyway. Oh, there's all sorts of cool things to be had. The tribal life. Ugh. Of course. That actually gave us a little bit of a hit there as well. We want this to keep going up. We will force your culture away, don't you worry. Ingavones? Ingavones? I believe so. Your unrest is almost gone now. So what else can we see? Can't see any major nations. These guys look fairly... Powerful looking, actually. Indeed, they are. That'd be an interesting start over here. You got the boys. Yeah, definitely quite interesting. My faithful allies are now my faithful enemies, which isn't great. But sure. And indeed, we are going to go for that national tax modifier when it comes. Although, the reality is we're not making any tax money, are we? So I won't do that. Because you need commoners to make any tax. So I'm going to ignore that, actually. Just 
wait for the money to come in. There's no wars we can fight. Okay, let's have a look at tech map again. Yeah, you guys. So let us just build this spy network. It probably won't help, but we'll see. We can get two 100 spy networks, which is insane, by the way. I don't understand why they've not failed. It mustn't be a mechanic in this. What we really want to do is take this land, take Denmark, take the coast, because you know there's going to be something. I'm not sure what what calendar system this is, but it's certainly not 248 AD. There was no Rome or anything like that when you start. Well, I think there was the, the city of Rome, but nothing else. Babylon is what's well, the archaic period, isn't it? So or before anything. Or even before the sort of early Greek period, so We'll make it though, don't you worry. We'll become strong. The Renaissance will start up here. And indeed if this goes well, I'm not even sure how long the campaign runs for. We will um, probably make a custom nation, probably, in EU4 to carry this on. Or maybe Crusader Kings, actually. We'll see. Who's technology going? Yeah, you can lose a little bit of Diplo. Minus 10%. Oh wait, that's taken over from Serretis. That's interesting. I'm quite far behind, actually. I imagine a couple of you guys are on fours now, yep. Yeah. Lemovian, Separatists, all good. We're so close to, to being able to build something. Maybe. Still not sure how it works. We did have minus 10% construction, but our king got plus 10% construction. So it's helped us in no way, shape or form. Obviously, we're making almost no money from trade whatsoever, so marketplace isn't really going to increase too much. So we might actually see if we can build anything else other than a marketplace. Have to be careful, though. Come on, please let us build. I don't think I can build, you know. We cannot construct more buildings in this province. Oh my god. So how do we do this? Is it about reforming our government maybe? So we need, we need population to reform our government. Oh I don't know what I'm doing at all. We certainly can't afford an advisor. Our income is slowly going up though. Okay, so the Rugai have collapsed again. So let's make the... Oh, it is ETI. Who else do we want to be? Verini? Where are the Verini? Yeah, that'll do. So what would be interesting is maybe getting a vassal. We're behind on tech, so that's not going to happen right now. We need to make more money. But there's not an awful lot to do with our money. Professional army. Could we start disciplining? Yeah, we can. Don't need to build a fleet. Build a road. Yeah, we could build roads, but I don't think... Didn't seem to be an option, did it? Let's go through all this. So much stuff. I really like having this many options. I'm sure CA, CA, Paradox won't come across my game, but loads of extra buildings would be great, guys. Just so you know. Okay, gravel roads. Or well, maybe. Okay, we can take up. Number of states and admin efficiency. How much separatism does it have? It still has some. Maybe we can build a road. I don't want to stop you guys though. Oh, for God's sake. Just use the king. Oops. Let's 
by network. That institution is killing us, isn't it? It is getting quite close to us, but writing system is not. Well, the writing system seems to be slowly spreading north, so we're about as far north as you can get, which maybe wasn't the best planning in the world. I still like it, though. Okay, we got the military tech. So if we declared war on you for no reason, you're allied with my allies. I wonder. I don't really want to take my spy networks away because they seem to be helping. Let's take away this guy because I know the others are. Oh. Do I have a new heir to the throne? Is that what just happened? rubbish. He's a misogynist. Perfect. Just what we want. That's a joke, by the way. I really don't want a misogynist. Um, quarry. There's new buildings. Small harbour. Be nice. You never know. I might be able to build a road. You still can't. I cannot build more buildings anywhere. So it's actually useless. If we declared war on you, everyone would help. Amazing. There's nothing I can do. Okay, I have a new king. And he's terrible. Let's hope he dies disciplining. Drilling. I keep calling that disciplining. Looked like our air was a little bit better. can we do, I wonder? Oh my god. <gasps> dun dun dun! Small marketplace. Or a shrine. So, first off. Okay, I can only build it in Scania. Oh, we've got a commoner population. My god. So, production buildings. An upper class. Probably better to. Oh, it's just that tax income looks better, I think. Yeah, I'm going to go for the tax income. Oh my god, we had a random. Something else? No. <laughs> Let's check out our census. I'm so excited. <laughs> Tribal population promoted to commoner population one. Dun dun dun. Okay, we've got national tax modifier. None of this probably matters too much. I think we'll keep the national tax modifier. My new king is shocking. God. Gain religious authority. Can we do anything for religion now? Ah, oh, we could. Sure, and explorer's fine. Let's go for construction cost, or would land maintenance be better? Yeah, I reckon it would be, you know. Land maintenance modifier. Let's go for the government. So now I have something to work towards, so you can stop drilling, actually. You've built. Well, actually, I don't have anything to work towards because there's no other population. So now there is a better chance that I will spawn, you know, upper class. There's a small chance that tribal population. Tribal population represents rural populations. And there's nothing you can do. I feel like that's wrong somehow. Well, they would be my ally again. Huh, that's funny. Njord has arrived. Oh, man. I really want to grow my population. We're going to Diplotech up again. You now have a tiny extra income, which is nice. Let's 
I just don't know what to do here. I will do some more research before the next episode. I don't think I'm missing anything. I think it is just like this. It's a long, long game. Have we seen any more of the world? No, not really. There's large scale wars going on and I'm not involved in them. Although I have definitely the easiest growth once I get a colonist. Again, couldn't afford one, so I'm not even going to worry about that. State maintenance, still nothing we can be done here. None of this would matter at all. We are going to go up in Diplotech, but that tech penalty is getting close to absurd. So how come you've got the writing system? Why is that spreading to you? Is it just because... Has upper class... You have upper class population, you son of a... How? God damn it. I need upper class. You've actually got quite good development. I still have the same population as when I... Okay, I don't really care about... Yeah, okay, the professionalism's not bad. Merchants of our allies. Yeah, let's gain mercantilism. Why not? Off the sailor. I'm just very eager to see if any of my populations change. How much longer? 2061. Not 2061. 261. So we've muffled them. I suppose so. I get a small, small bonus. An extra 0 0.01. Insane. Okay, I suppose we will... Um, Keep getting that government bonus. Is there anything like that we can do here? Not really. Court priest isn't going to help us at all. Can't afford him. Going to get an extra diplotech. Increased trade range. Going to build a small harbour. None of this will help though. Hopefully it'll increase our income just a tiny touch. I'm falling a bit behind though, so I'm going to have to be careful. Okay, I can make a state. Not sure that would be relevant. It'll cost us 0 0.01 in maintenance and it'll increase our income. Okay, okay. Okay, so it's not giving me any income. Thanks for that. And um, we need new clans. We'll stick clans in here. There you go. Yeah, let's turn you Nordic. Why not? We'll just take up and we'll call it an episode after that. I'm hoping institutions are going to start spreading. They're pretty close now. Oh, a mission fulfilled. Professional army. Gain army tradition. It's not really going to help, but thank you. So it's all about growth. We just have to keep getting stronger. We want to colonize. Ah, oh, these are wasteland. That's a shame. want to colonize Orlando. Okay, we've got a regency. It's probably alright. Our king was terrible. Yeah, just take the military power ahead. That's fine. 
What's our king gonna be like? Mm, he's alright. Well, I'd rather have 633. Come on, we're almost here. Okay, we had to take a small hit there. Of course we did. Any great power changes? I'm intrigued to see the income come. In fact, let's see the biggest armies. Oh, we can't see anything. About economy. It's all about the Helvetii, which I believe are down near Switzerland. Yep. You're all doing a little bit better than me. One of the better productions, though. Ah, there our ancient was discovered. 897. Nobody else? Just eagerly clicking through, hoping for the best. Heck, you never know. I just wish I knew that if there was a way to increase the pop tribal population. I feel like that should be a thing. But I don't know how or why. Oh man. It's moving further away from me every time. Next click hopefully. Okay. Diplomatic tech. Trade range. Can now build a small harbour. Okay we'll call it there. So do remember to click that like button. Please offer advice on this one. I have no real idea what I'm doing. I feel like we're completely safe, but we're not growing, we're not really doing anything other than slowly taking up. But anyway, thanks very much. Click like button, subscribe, and I'll see you for the next one.